Which one of the following countries is the largest producer of bauxite? A. Guinea. B. Australia. C. India. D. Jamaica. The correct answer is, A. Guinea. Guinea is the world's largest producer of bauxite, accounting for 25% of global production in 2020. The country's bauxite reserves are estimated to be 7.4 billion tons, the largest in the world. Bauxite is a mineral ore that is the main source of aluminum. It is used in the production of aluminum metal, which is used in a wide range of products, including cars, aircraft, and buildings. Australia is the second largest producer of bauxite, accounting for 15% of global production in 2020. The country's bauxite reserves are estimated to be 4.4 billion tons. India is the third largest producer of bauxite, accounting for 10% of global production in 2020. The country's bauxite reserves are estimated to be 3.4 billion tons. Jamaica is the fourth largest producer of bauxite, accounting for 6% of global production in 2020. The country's bauxite reserves are estimated to be 2.1 billion tons. The global demand for bauxite is expected to grow by 2% per year over the next five years. This growth is being driven by the increasing demand for aluminum, which is used in a wide range of products, including cars, aircraft, and buildings. Which one of the following places has the lowest annual rainfall? A. Bellari. B. Jaslamar. C. Jodhpur. D. Let. The correct answer is, D. Let. Let is a city in the Let district of Ladakh, India. It is the capital of Ladakh and is located at an altitude of 3,500 meters, 11,500 feet, above sea level. Let is a popular tourist destination due to its stunning scenery and its proximity to the Himalayas. The annual rainfall in Let is very low, averaging only 100 millimeters, 4 inches, per year. This is due to the fact that Let is located in a rain shadow area, which is an area that receives little rainfall because of the presence of mountains. The mountains block the moisture-laden clouds from reaching Let, resulting in very low rainfall. The low rainfall in Let has a significant impact on the city's climate. The climate in Let is very dry and cold, with average temperatures ranging from minus 10 degrees Celsius, 14 degrees Fahrenheit, in winter to 20 degrees Celsius, 68 degrees Fahrenheit, in summer. The low rainfall also means that there is very little vegetation in Le, which gives the city a barren and desolate appearance. Despite the low rainfall, Le is a beautiful and fascinating city. The city's stunning scenery, its proximity to the Himalayas, and its unique culture make it a popular tourist destination. Whom of the following classified the world into agricultural regions initially? A. Whittlesey. B. Helburn. C. Dudley Stamp. D. Harchern. The correct answer is, C. Dudley Stamp. Dudley Stamp, 1898-1966, was a British geographer who is best known for his work on agricultural regions. In 1936, he published a book called The Land of Britain, Its Use and Misuse, which classified the world into agricultural regions based on their climate, soil, and vegetation. His work was influential in the development of agricultural geography and is still used today. A. Whittlesey was an American geographer who is best known for his work on political geography. He published a book called The Earth and the State, a study of political geography in 1939. B. Helburn was a German geographer who is best known for his work on regional planning. He published a book called Die Are Unspecified Currency Umlich und der Wirtschaft in 1949. D. Harchern was an American geographer who is best known for his work on the philosophy of geography. He published a book called The Nature of Geography in 1939. In which state the Nelong Valley is located? A. Himachal Pradesh. B. Sikkim. C. Jammu and Kashmir. D. Uttarakhand. The correct answer is, D. Uttarakhand. The Nelong Valley is a valley in the Garewal Himalayas in the Indian state of Uttarakhand. It is located in the Chamoli district, about 200 kilometers from the state capital, Dehradun. The valley is about 50 kilometers long and 10 kilometers wide, and is surrounded by mountains on all sides. The main river in the valley is the Nelong River, which flows from the glaciers in the Himalayas to the Ganges River. The valley is home to a number of villages, and is a popular tourist destination. The other options are incorrect. Himachal Pradesh is a state in the Indian Himalayas. Sikkim is a state in the Eastern Himalayas. Jammu and Kashmir is a state in the Northwestern Himalayas. Which one of the following ranges is not a Trans-Himalayan range? A. Purpanjal. B. Zaskar. C. Karakoram. D. Kalos. The correct answer is, D. Kalos is not a Trans-Himalayan range. It is a mountain range in the Himalayas, located in the Tibet Autonomous Region of China and the Indian state of Jammu and Kashmir. The range is part of the Gangdais Mountains, which are a sub-range of the Himalayas. The Kalos range is home to Mount Kailash, a sacred mountain for Hindus, Buddhists, and Jains. The Purpanjal range is a mountain range in the Himalayas, located in the Indian states of Jammu and Kashmir and Himachal Pradesh. The range is part of the Western Himalayas, 
and is a subrange of the Purpanjal Himalayas. The Purpanjal range is the longest mountain range in the Himalayas, and is home to several peaks over 6,000 meters, 19,685 feet, in elevation. The Zaskar range is a mountain range in the Himalayas, located in the Indian state of Jammu and Kashmir and the Ladakh Autonomous Region of India. The range is part of the Zanskar Himalayas, which are a sub-range of the Himalayas. The Zaskar range is home to several peaks over 7,000 meters, 23,000 feet, in elevation, including Nunkun, which is the second highest peak in the Zanskar Himalayas. The Karak Oram range is a mountain range in the Himalayas, located in the Gilgit Baltistan region of Pakistan, the Ladakh Autonomous Region of India, and the Xinjiang Uyghur Autonomous Region of China. The range is part of the Trans Himalayan Ranges, which are a series of mountain ranges that lie north of the Himalayas. The Karak Oram Range is the highest mountain range outside of the Himalayas, and is home to several peaks over 8,000 meters, 26,247 feet, including K2, which is the second highest mountain in the world. The town of Kalpi is situated on the bank of river. A Gunga. B Yamuna. C Nirmada. D Krishna. The correct answer is, B. Kalpi is a town in the Jalan district of Uttar Pradesh, India. It is situated on the banks of the Yamuna River, about 200 kilometers, 120 miles, from Agra. The town is known for its temples, mosques, and historical monuments. The Yamuna is one of the major rivers of India. It is a tributary of the Ganges River and is considered to be one of the holiest rivers in Hinduism. The Yamuna is also a major source of irrigation for the Ganges Basin. The other options are incorrect. The Ganga is a river in northern India and northern Bangladesh. It is the longest river in India and the third longest river in Asia. The Nirmada is a river in central India. It is the fifth longest river in India. The Krishna is a river in southern India. It is the second longest river in India after the Ganges. Where was the fifth summit conference of LBSA, Organization of India, Brazil, and South Africa, held in 2011? A. New Delhi. B. Pretoria. C. Brasilia. D. Victoria. The correct answer is, C. The fifth summit conference of LBSA, Organization of India, Brazil, and South Africa, was held in Brasilia, Brazil in 2011. The summit was attended by the leaders of the three countries, namely, Prime Minister Manmohan Singh of India, President Luiz Inácio Lula da Silva of Brazil and President Jacob Zuma of South Africa. The summit discussed a wide range of issues of mutual interest, including trade, investment, energy, agriculture, climate change, and multilateral cooperation. The LBSA is a trilateral forum that was established in 2003 by India, Brazil, and South Africa. The forum aims to promote cooperation among the three countries in a number of areas, including trade, investment, agriculture, science, and technology, education and culture. The LBSA has been successful in promoting cooperation among the three countries and has helped to strengthen their ties. The fifth summit conference of LBSA was a significant event in the history of the forum. The summit reaffirmed the commitment of the three countries to work together to promote their common interests. The summit also agreed to a number of initiatives to strengthen cooperation among the three countries. The fifth summit conference of LBSA was a success and helped to further strengthen the ties between India, Brazil, and South Africa. Option, A, New Delhi, is incorrect because the fifth summit conference of LBSA was not held in New Delhi. The fifth summit conference of LBSA was held in Brasilia, Brazil. Option, B, Pretoria, is incorrect because the fifth summit conference of LBSA was not held in Pretoria. The fifth summit conference of LBSA was held in Brasilia, Brazil. Option, D, Victoria, is incorrect because the fifth summit conference of LBSA was not held in Victoria. The fifth summit conference of LBSA was held in Brasilia, Brazil. Which of the following pairs is correctly matched? Minerals producing areas. A. Copper, Arizona. B. Coal, Carajas. C. Iron ore, Rastanura. D. Petroleum, Donbas. The correct answer is, A. Copper is produced in Arizona. B. Coal is produced in Australia, China, India, Indonesia, and the United States. C. Iron ore is produced in Australia, Brazil, China, India, and Russia. D. Petroleum is produced in Saudi Arabia, Russia, the United States, Iraq, and Iran. Arizona is a state in the southwestern region of the United States. It is the sixth largest and the fourteenth most populous of the fifty states. Its capital and largest city is Phoenix. Arizona is the southwesternmost U.S. state, and is bordered by Mexico to the south and the states of California to the west, Nevada and Utah to the north, New Mexico to the east, and Colorado to the northeast. The Grand Canyon, a steep-sided canyon carved by the Colorado River, is a significant natural feature in the state. Copper is a chemical element with the symbol Cu and atomic number 29. It is a soft, malleable, and ductile metal with very high thermal and electrical conductivity. 
Copper is a transition metal and is the second most abundant element in the Earth's crust, after oxygen. It is a major component of many industrial materials, including electrical wiring, plumbing, and roofing. Copper is also used in coins, jewelry, and art objects. Coal is a fossil fuel formed from the remains of ancient plants that have been buried and subjected to intense heat and pressure over millions of years. Coal is a non-renewable resource, meaning that it cannot be replaced once it is used up. Coal is used to generate electricity, produce steel, and make chemicals. Iron ore is a rock or mineral that contains iron. Iron ore is the primary raw material used to make iron and steel. Iron ore is found in many parts of the world, but the largest deposits are located in Australia, Brazil, China, India, and Russia. Petroleum is a fossil fuel formed from the remains of ancient organisms that have been buried and subjected to intense heat and pressure over millions of years. Petroleum is a non-renewable resource, meaning that it cannot be replaced once it is used up. Petroleum is used to produce gasoline, diesel fuel, jet fuel, and other products. The headquarters of the European Union are located at A. Brussels B. Helsinki C. Paris D. Rome The correct answer is A. Brussels The European Union, EU, is a political and economic union of 27 member states that are located primarily in Europe. The EU operates through a system of supranational institutions and intergovernmental negotiated decisions by the member states. It aims to bring about the coordination of member states' economic policies, a single market in which goods and people move freely, and common policies on trade, agriculture, fisheries, and regional development. The headquarters of the EU are located in Brussels, Belgium. The city is also home to the Council of the European Union, the European Commission, and the European Parliament. The other options are incorrect. B. Helsinki is the capital of Finland. C. Paris is the capital of France. D. Rome is the capital of Italy. The Commonwealth Games 2010 will be held at A. Canberra B. Delhi C. London D. Toronto The correct answer is B. Delhi The Commonwealth Games is an international multi-sport event involving athletes from the Commonwealth of Nations. The Games were first held in 1930 in Hamilton, Ontario, Canada and have been held every four years since then, except for the period during World War II. The 2010 Commonwealth Games were held in Delhi, India, from 3 to October 14, 2010. The Games were the largest sporting event ever held in India, with over 7,000 athletes from 71 nations competing in 34 sports. The other options are incorrect because, A. Canberra is the capital of Australia. The Commonwealth Games were not held in Canberra in 2010. C. London is the capital of England. The Commonwealth Games were not held in London in 2010. D. Toronto is the capital of Ontario, Canada. The Commonwealth Games were not held in Toronto in 2010.